Yo, yo, Josh, yo, super pumped tonight. Aperture multicolored pocket LED is finally here. I've known about these since NAB. By now, you've probably heard ad nauseum about these lights and they're cheap, $90 a pop. And they have a ton of features packed in here. Let's be honest, these are like the ultimate gorilla filmmaker lights, mostly because the price is affordable. The portability is insane. They're magnetic. They wirelessly charge, and best of all, when you mix them with a trigger clamp and a cheese plate, you can mount them anywhere. If you don't know what this is, that's because you haven't worked with your hands. Trigger clamp, they're $6. You can get them at Home Depot. These are freaking awesome. Did I tell you they're magnetic? Oh, wow, that's actually, that's actually pretty bright. All right, so once inside the box, we got this bad boy here, comes with a very nice pouch. You guys know how I feel about pouches. I will never use this pouch. Looks like we got some extra Velcro. I'm not sure what this is gonna be. Is this a diffuser? Oh, that's actually pretty nice. I mean, look how soft that is. Okay, all right, I changed my mind. This is actually really handy. That solves the biggest problem. See, with diffusion, you need a space. You need the material to diffuse it, but you actually need to add a little bit of space. And the genius design around this, looks like it gives you about a half an inch space, which is just enough to really make that light really, really soft. And of course, we got a USB-C power cable. So the 2600 milliamp battery can run full brightness for two hours. If you plug it into an external battery bank, big old brick by Indie Pro, and you'll be running this for days. Yep, charging. I love the creativity of these types of RGB lights, particularly because you can add color contrast. So color contrast, we talked about this before. When you have complementary colors opposite on the color wheel, you can add a layer of contrast to your subject depending on where you add the light. So behind me, we have tungsten. So the opposite of that would be teal. Let's see if we add a nice kicker light right here. It kind of complements, it just adds a layer of complexity. All right, so this is not only an upgrade to the popular M9, but it's fully RGB addressable, which means you can create up to 36,000 different combinations of colors using one of these lights. They have an app that you can sync up that actually freaking works. Wait, the app is called Sidious. <laughs> Bro, I don't know if I can use this app. All right, I'll use this app. Like we can cluster them together in groups and control all of them. You can do things like change the color temperature, change intensity, hue, that kind of thing. But then you can even take a photograph of a light source and it'll try to match it. We can even trigger special effects. If you hold down the trigger wheel, it'll bring up this menu, the FX menu. So we got paparazzi. <laughs> You get the idea. Faulty bulb. I swear to God, I'm gonna fix that bulb. The problem is not this bulb, it's the sound. That is just so annoying. Ooh, we got TV. This is pretty dope. We got a TV shot. The sports legend was under a great deal of financial stress at the time of the murders. And I might even sprout a chest hair or two. <laughs> Party, uh, I'm hard pass. Ooh, cop car. This is a super easy one. Oh shit, what's happening outside? Fire? But how realistic can this be? Let yeah, even at a young age, I, I knew I wanted to sell Amway products. Guys, I hate to be a dick, but if you can't figure out how to make your film with a camera and this, give up filmmaking. For this next one, I don't want it to be visible. I want it to be behind this. So I'll just clamp it onto the wood. All right, this hallway's already <laughs> creepy, but maybe we can make it a little creepier. Check this out. Hello? Creepy. Uh. 
No more. I'm done. That was a close one.